drawings have lots and lots of layouts, you can use these buttons over here, or you can use the new layout manager. This video, I'll show you how. In the past, BricsCAD has offered two methods of controlling layouts interactively. One is to uh, select a layout tab, right click, and then choose one of the options here. So we have new for creating a new one. This uh, from template is to create a new one based on a template. This deletes it, this renames it, this makes a copy of it. These two move the tab left or right relative to the others. And then these go into page setup, print and export commands. The other way to uh, control a large number of layout tabs is to use these buttons here. These move you through one at a time. Uh, this button takes you to the last one. And this button takes you to the first one. BricsCAD version 18 introduces a third way to deal with lots of layout tabs. And that's done through clicking this little button right here. It's easy to miss, but once you click it, this dialog box appears. And it's called a layout manager. It lets you create, remove, and move around layouts all within a single dialog box. It's really meant for drawings that have lots and lots of layout tabs. As you can see here in the search field where you can search for specific names and then work with it. Let me drag this over here and I'll make it longer so you can see all the tabs that are listed here. I deliberately put in a whole bunch of repetitive tabs and I can delete those. Click the first one in a series, hold down the shift key, click the last one and then delete them and there they go. Now there's two ways to create new ones. One is to uh, simply click the new button and you get a new layout there. The other one is to take an existing layout, let's say this one, and then click copy and it makes a copy of the layout. It gets the same name but gets incremented with a number as you can see in these other layouts. These two arrow buttons move layouts up and down the list. Let's select this one and that one by holding down the shift key and I can't drag them up and down uh, but I can use these arrows to move them along and down on the uh, tab bar down here you can watch them also being moved in real time. Let me delete those. Now the other function you can do in this dialog box is to uh, uh, double click one, do it over here at the number, double click it and you immediately go to that tab. Final nugget from BricsCAD version 18 is that the uh, display of the layouts are cached. As you switch between them, they are viewed instantly. There's no waiting for them to redraw. Down on the command prompt, you see that that's going on. You get there the report that it's caching the viewports and that it's reusing the data.